to Transforming Thursday. Um, Transforming Thursdays, those of you who are new to my channel are where um, we have collabed with Transforming Melody and Spanky Cola. And we come in and we kind of share our journey and how our week went as far as this weight loss journey. Um, because we believe that it's something that we change internally and externally. So we kind of come in and we kind of express our thoughts and our feelings for the week. And I will link them down below. So please go check them out. They're amazing women. Um, so we'll get right into it. So this week has been a very stable week for me, I should say, definitely. Um, it's the week after Shark Week. So surprising enough, um, I have measured myself a couple days ago just to see where I was. Um, I am currently doing the six-week program with Jessica Smith, and I am on week three. So I have lost two inches around my tummy and a half inch on both arms and I'm still the same in my legs. Um, even though I'm still the same in my legs, I see the toning it's coming in. Um, I have been really hitting those squats. Um, so definitely happy about that. And as far as my weigh-in, we'll get right into it. Hi everyone, so Thursday, May 5th, live weigh-in. So you guys see, I am actually down 0.4. And I'm okay with it, is the week after Shark Week. And usually in the past, um, I will be saying to myself, oh, don't worry, you know, it's water weight and... Um, and I will be telling you that I've been gaining um, because that week for me, like I'm um, ovulating and all that good stuff. So my body kind of like retains, you know, some water and all that good stuff. And I can tell, you know, how my um, rings feel and all that good stuff. But I'm down 0.4 and I am completely okay with it. I'm actually um, happy. I will not be um, checking nothing off my chart because I want to check out whole numbers. Um, and I'm only, yeah, I'm 226.4, um, 0.6, I'm sorry, super excited, I'm down 0.4, the scale is headed in the right direction, um, definitely, um, this week as far as me and yesterday I took lunch and I kind of like just meditated on me and how I'm doing and when I tell you girls and guys, um, as far as meditating for me, I sit here and I kind of, there's a lot on my plate like I had mentioned before, um, but when it comes down to this weight loss journey and this transformation, like I stop being a mommy, I stop being a wife, I stop being a friend, like I concentrate on me and what's going on with me personally. Um, it's needed in this journey, even though we have so much that we're responsible for. We just need to be a little self-centered, especially if you are taking that time to yourself and like really evaluate where you're at, how you're feeling. Um, so you definitely, you know, want to be a little selfish and just think about you. Um, and I tell you guys this, I am constantly, I'm a shopaholic. I love bargains, um, so I'm always, you know, in Goodwill and a good sale and everything else. And I have accessories, and I have clothes, and I have shoes, um, and when I go shopping, I'm like, oh yes, this and this will look great together, and, you know, and this and this. But you know what, that's as far as it goes. Like, it it, it gets to my closet. I get to put it out, I get to hang it up, but that's where it stays. And I said to myself, you know, back when, I used to love to get all dialed up and all dressed up and coordinated, and I let myself go for a long time. Um, so last week, um, my um, goal for the week was to make sure that I did my makeup the whole week. And I achieved it, and it felt so good. Um, and yes, this whole week, I also want to go ahead and make sure I get, you know, my makeup done. But I'm also want to incorporate my style. You know, I want to get to, I want to love myself again. And you know, 
when we give ourselves enough time to really realize who we are who we turning into that diva that has always been inside and this is why i always call you girls divas and dolls because that is just you know who we are inside we just kind of like just put us aside just to deal with everything else and it's time to bring that diva out again you know so i said to myself you know what nope so i am picking out clothes i'm bringing out shoes boots whatever the case may be to put that outfit together i'm gonna do it um and i'm excited you know i will show you guys a quick clip of my outfit looks like today And just something simple, you know, I kind of just want to put a jacket with a shirt, you know, and boots and kind of bring on my accessories because I'm just tired of having my stuff just collecting dust and not using it. Um, so definitely getting to that point where loving myself through this journey, you know, and this brings me to my main topic is you have to love yourself now. Don't say, oh, I'm going to, I'll do that once I get there. Or, you know, I'll wear that type of outfit. No, you want to wear it now? Wear it. You have to love yourself in the process to be able to get to goal. Um, and I've noticed that for me, it has made such a huge difference. You know, when you carry yourself, when you're all dialed up and you're very well put together, you carry yourself with, ch with such class. And it just comes almost immediately. It's not something that you have to say, oh, okay. No, it just happens, you know. And it's because of how you feel and in return people see you and they they even unfortunately to say they treat you differently um and that's just society you know when they see a woman or a man that's very well put together that takes a couple minutes to take care of themselves unfortunately society like sees you and they treat you how you treat yourself you treat yourself with respect society's going to treat you with respect um and it's sad to say but that's just you know it's just how it is um, so just love yourself in the process, you know, um, dig into your closets, put those outfits together, you know, um, take out your, your accessories and I'm sure you guys are, you know, like me, it's, I'm always shopping, I'm always buying new things, you know, and it's just, I tell you, these earrings, they're guests, which I love, I love guests and I had came across them in Google brand new and I think I paid three dollars for them they retail for like 75 dollars and I never wore them and I've had them for at least no lie a year I was like you know what I'm gonna put those guest earrings on today bam you know and the boots I have on today the ankle boots I've had them for at least I don't know a year a year and a half and I've never worn them you know so dig to your closet take stuff out you know organize and see you know and diva out we got to do it. So with that said, I will leave it here. I hope everyone has a blessed week. Thank you for stopping by. Welcome to my new subscribers. And you know what? We're in this journey. And like I've always said, we've come too far to go back. So we just embrace, you know, where we're at and what we want to do. So I hope everyone has a blessed, fantastic day. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Mwah.